Welcome to Line Up Wars with Stephen Phil and special guest Ian. Hello. So hi everyone. Hello everyone. And uh, yeah, Ian's with us today because, uh, as well, these are his own words, he's old <laughs> and yeah. he has the original Star Fox or Star Wing in yes. England yeah. on the snares and he just wants to see it looking absolutely glorified in... Uh, Nintendo 64 graphics as it were. No polygon. Whilst we have obviously Lilac Wars, Star Fox 64 everywhere, everywhere else. Yeah. Um, uh, now available for the 3DS. Yes, which um, is very good and I recommend you buy it. Yeah, but we'll, we'll get back probably to, back to that near the end of the playthrough. Anyway, let's just get started. Now we could do training, but... But we're uh, not going to because we know how to do this game. it's a waste of time. We're, this is the virtual console version, so uh, not much has changed here really. It's just that it's... Better with a game control. Cool. Yeah. Can't be bothered to get my N64 out. Yeah. And uh, here we have the old, like, you know, Star Wars thing with the scroll of text and planets and crap. And basically what's happened. Yeah. So, but, yes, before before we actually start, I just have to say through gritted teeth that my friend Gavin, if you have been watching Banjo Kazooie, uh, you know how much how I feel about Banjo Kazooie Nuts and Bolts. And my friend Gavin, for my birthday, went and bought me a copy of Nuts and Bolts. And I can say my complaints are justified. Anyway, back on with Star Fox. So basically, this is the basic story. So obviously, uh, James McCloud, Pigma, and Peppy decided to um, fight back against Andros. They were, they were the Star Fox before yeah. the actual Star Fox from all the games. So, um, a few years uh, so yeah, and uh, Andros has Andros again invaded is a, the Lilac is an system. Twat, frankly, pretty much. Uh, has turned to a new Star Fox team, and James McCloud was well, never was never seen again. Presumably and dead. The um, Peppy was the only one who got again. back, and Pigma obviously changed sides. Yeah, That's betrayed what them. The story said. And now we are now on the new one. The Lilac system. So here we are, Lilac system. Uh, here we go. As you can see, I haven't got all. The oh, I've only got one medal. No, two. You're missing. Yeah, you're missing sector Z, Zona, sector Z, and Solar. I we'll think. explain <laughs> why medals could be uh, a good thing later on, but I, I might have to show some footage on other. Uh, but, but we're, we're, other, we're not going for medals today because it'll take too long. No, exactly. Right, so, might as well uh, start yeah, with here's... with Corneria, Really, that's the light system. Now that, we're going to take uh, the, 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 normal, the basic route. The normal route. There are the, shortcuts yeah. on the majority of levels, but um, multiple routes you can we'll take to, to get to different I'll levels. X, Y, Z. You know. Andros won't have his way with me. The uh, the voice acting is top notch in this game as well. Compared especially to this, compared to the 3DS one, <laughs> this is so much better. <laughs> especially uh, especially when Star Wolf show up, and you'll see you'll see why later. So here we got uh, Gar um, go oh. to start off with. Uh, so, He's Star Fox, Fox McCloud, leader of the group. <laughs> the, as he said, the graphics compared to the first one, uh, much better. This is Halo 4 graphics right here. <laughs> yeah. I'm amazed. So here's Falco, the ace, ace pilot. The general arse of the group, basically. Uh, yes, yeah, so you'll see he's very, very cocky. Peppy, the old hand. He's the scientist. Uh, yeah, in later games he was basically stuck on Grey Fox. <laughs> and here's Slippy, who Slippy. everyone doesn't like. Nobody Great likes him, mechanic. and he doesn't have a gender. He has no gender. So I'm just throwing that out there. Falcon <laughs> and and Fox McCloud. Here we go. To be fair, James McCloud wasn't very inventive when he named his son. No. Motto, you're a fox. Done. So here we go. So the, the so medal score is 150 human. on this level. Do a barrel roll. Uh, <laughs> That's going to be said <laughs> you'll a see lot. That. You'll, you'll see that. <laughs> Especially the first couple of levels. Now, yeah, as you see there, we're getting. Um, you can charge up the shots, and if you wait for enemies to form ranks, go into formation, you can charge up and get more points. And yeah, you often have to save him. The only other way, <laughs> and the only other way to get medals is where you must make sure your whole squad stays alive. Yeah, all four teammates all have four to survive. All four teammates have to stay on a level. If a teammate gets downed. Um, they are absent from the following level, so if you're trying to get the, level, the medal in the next level, they won't be in it either. So you have to make sure they survive. Because, you know, they seem to, they're, they're, they're fantastic pilots, they can't do it themselves. Right, these gold rings, get three as you see, I've just flushed one up. Uh, will, well, for one, give you health, same as silver rings. Yep. But it'll also uh, increase your health gauge once you get three. If you get a further three after your health gauge is increased, you get an extra life. Quick trick, go through the little buildings there, a few more enemies spawn. Those things are great because you give you five hits, or well, six hits technically, every time. 
Oh, I ain't got one on the bridge. So let's use the brake. Yeah, use the brake! Um. Are oh, you using bombs early? Yeah, it's just. <laughs> Yeah, it's right. just basic level. How does it, how does it match up to uh, Corneria in uh, Star Fox? Like I said earlier, the graphics. Are, uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm still this is hard. shocking all. I, I'm still shocking all over here. I quite feel like talking for three hours. Wow. <laughs> As you see, I've already upgraded my laser to, double laser to double laser. Yeah, this is like a hyper laser already. Um, get another yeah, one. Upgrade. Oh and shit, and the famous line's coming up, get ready. Everyone here we go, here we go. And yeah, 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 that's where it spawns from. <laughs> but yeah, if you get um, well, yeah, what well, like Steve was saying, one laser upgrade gives you double green lasers, another one gives double blue, and double blue is like what you want for the entire game. Yeah. Remember not to fly through them. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we'll get back to that later. And uh, look at those water effects. Those water textures are amazing. A full game is sold when you see you see that. Stuff which actually has a reflection on the bloody water as well. It's and good. some downdraft as well when you're flying over. Now that thing, we'll say later. It's also the first boss from the first level of Star Fox. Yes. Except if you go the normal route this way, you get to fight a brand new boss. The enemy robot. Oh, I'm not going to get another one. Just, I'm just about not Oh, you needed one. three more and you would have got one. Yeah, most of the. Um, most of the medals normally come from the alternate route. Yeah. Uh, as you'll see later on, especially with the Meteor. Now this boss is so easy. All you have to do is shoot his leg off. Which I failed to do. <laughs> we'll do it in a minute. In a minute. See, now we can, rather than being on the rails, we can now fly around in a Yeah, this is the all range mode. Uh, I'll show you a U-turn. So that's press it, quickly pressing the brake and the back stick. On the GameCube control, that's X. Yeah. See now he should be on the floor. Yeah, you just shoot him in the back and then you're done. <laughs> uh, I'll also show them this can be done anywhere. Uh, if you press down and boost or Y on the game controller, you can do a somersault. Which is very useful if you're being tailed. Yeah, so all you got to do for that guy is shoot his leg off and then just shoot him in the back <laughs> and then you're done. <laughs> and awesome explosion. Now the music on this level I don't particularly like compared to the Star Fox, the first one, even though I've never played it. Yes, if uh, any eagle-eared listeners will notice it was used as the intro theme uh, for the last few episodes of Banjo-Kazooie. Like Ian's one of the only five people that watches it. Yeah. <laughs> so far. You okay over there, Fox? They gain a bit of health obviously at the end of the level, so they don't just stick to that, so yeah. as you can see there. <clears throat> I've just missed the medal. <laughs> it's fine, don't mind. Got it already on that level anyway, so don't need it. Right, so that's Corneria, everybody. Welcome to the new series, and we'll see you next time on, well, depending which route you take. Uh, you'll, well, depending which video you view. Either this, for this video, you see it's Meteo, but Meteo. it could be Sector Y, depending which way you want to go. But at the moment, 